opening night of the 2024 Banana Ball World Tour. Banana Ball! We got about to get a trick play right here. Oh! <laughs> Give me that. Oh, it's caught by a fan. The triple trick play. Kicked off by Fisher. One, two, three. Showtime. Ethan Scooja, Mr. Worldwide, a guy who has played all over this great earth of ours. It is a powerful party animals lineup that will face him, though. And that one will clip him. How about that? Tears galore for Cornette. But his manager is going to carry him to first base. That one will get the bottom of the zone right at the knees for every strikeout. He gets on the mound. He's adding another bucket hat on top of his head. And now we'll see if Garrett Delano can come through with the bags full here in the top of the first. But here, Ryan Cox with the bags full goes between the legs and the club magician gets his first trick play of the season. Tampa! Eric Jones Jr. has the fate of the inning in his hand. That one smacked out into right center. Eric Jones Jr. walks off the first inning, and the Nanners out in front, one point to nothing. Swanee, another second year man for the party animals. And back up the middle, he is so clutch. He drives an ACA, and now the animals will dance their patented celebration. Right around home plate. Due to Risa Lexiades, the 2023 MVP of the Pioneer League. And this one is fouled away by Reese. Oh, it's caught by a fan! And his first at bat ends with a foul out to a man in the stands. And Ryan Cox at the dish. And here Ryan Cox lifts this one out to right. <laughs> Jake Skull goes down to his knees and worms out the trick play catch. Let's have a party. And Fisher coming in with the Toby Keith anthem to honor a true country music legend. Scooge, bring, Scooge brings in Cox, Olsen, and Meadows for the choreographed dance. Bill getting into it. Vincent shaking his tukis. And it's lined over the head of the doctor. Fisher two for two to begin his banana ball career. Garrett Delano scolds that one to center. DR doesn't have to move a step. Tagging from third is Skull, the throw offline. And the party animals push a run across. <laughs> it's like that is a DJ dupe. They were ready to rage. And Dancing Queen came on. See if Acuff goes from first, he does. Pitch bounce back to Scooge. And he is get, tries a trick play. And now the party animals are up three runs in this inning. Now Michael Vitamin D, single up the middle his first time. Taps this one to first, Swan grabs it, there's one, throw to first. Leroy's in trouble. He's in a pickle and will be tagged out by Noah Fisher. Justin Baber will lead off the frame. Zach Phillips, the new man on the mound. Yeah, I'm about to get a trick play right here. I believe it. Yeah, it felt right, I got this one too. Oh! <laughs> Give me that. Oh! Give me that on the mic. Give me that on the mic. Unreal. Ryan Cox between the legs and the treble. I Cox! Up. I called it. You're unbelievable. This is my best You're friend. Unbelievable. You're unbelievable. You're this unbelievable. is so cool. As Rat comes up for his second banana ball at bat. Lines it. That one ricochets off the glove of Jason Swan. It will tie the inning. Down into the right field corner. It goes. Racks thinking three bases. And he's got him. He slides into third. No throw. Chop to Acuff. Throw home. In time to get Rack. Tyler Gillum wants his base runners to be as aggressive as possible. And now this one on the ground. Party Animals will oh, try for the double play. Unbelievable. Baber bounce pass to Acuff. And on to first keeps the inning tied. A twin killing to save the frame. A lot of funky scoring decisions to be made this evening. He's off the bags. Run will score on this. Behind the back to second. Jackson Olsen never had a chance. Third trick play of the evening for Ryan Cox as you get another gander here. The pride of Hudson, Florida. Sean Fluke with the mic on him. Oh, my God. We absolutely love him to death. He has so many fans here right now. He actually pitched here 
on the mound when he played for Pasco and Amanda. Now, did he take the shirt off then? No. Oh. no. <laughs> and then again, he had a better body back then, too. What do you say about his body? Oh, here it comes. Oh, here it comes. The bounce from second. Fluke, will he do it? Come on. Whoa, there we go. The entire has joined us in the broadcast booth. As you can see, scared the dickens out of me. Justin Baber chugs a beer. He's ready to rumble. Zach Phillips quick pinching him. And, oh, no, wow. Golly. And what a play by Eric Jones Jr. Again, we'll see how patient Reese is here as he might try and take ball four instead. Popping this one up, throws the bat away in disgust. D.R. Meadows goes behind the back and comes up with the trick play catch. Are you kidding me, D.R.? A season ago, Drew Gillespie comes in to relieve Sean Fluke, who goes five very strong innings. And EJ is going to try for two bases. Head first slide. He's out. Incredible sprint defense by the party animals. And how about this? We've got the fan challenge being utilized here. They want to see if EJ might have gotten into second base safely after all. Excellent angle right here. He's Call out. stands. He's out. Call stands. Gillespie behind 1-0 will bring Acuff, Baber, and Hampton in for a choreographed dance. He'll grab Thomas from left and Skull from right as well. There is a lot of emotion in what is a very soft song going to mark it as a trick play missed four. That one into right field. It's a moot point right now. The Bananas walk off the sixth inning. And Rack leading the walk-off celebration. Bananas bring part of the infield in. Cox close to halfway at short. And Noah Fisher blasts this one. Deep out to left center. It's going to be grabbed by Meadows just in front of the track. Cornette can waltz home. Skull will jog to third. Jesse Cole announcing that Dakota Stilts Albritton will lead off in a pivotal situation here for the Nanners. He barrels that to third. Bounced to Acuff, to Baber, to Swan. The triple trick play. Kicked off by Fisher. A beauty from the Party Animals infield. A play we have never before seen in Banana Ball. In the final inning, every run counts for a point. Party Animals looking to build on their two-point advantage. Every run scored will count as a point. And that one barreled out to left center field. It's big time trouble. And belly flop into third with a triple to lead off the top of the ninth. Noah Fisher cannot be stopped for the party animals in his banana ball debut. Fisher off third, payoff pitch. This is high. It'll be a ribeye for Thomas. Reese Alexiades. And in a good banana ball debut, spoiled a bit by fouling out to a fan in his first ever at bat. There goes Reese, trying to steal first base. Throw from Cornette, not in time. That is a massive leadoff man aboard for the Nanners. They need one more guy to reach, and then they can bring the game's tying run to the dish. Ladies and gentlemen, the Bananas are going to the golden batter, stepping up to the plate. Please welcome Tan Oberst. The Largo, Florida kid will be the first ever golden batter in banana ball history. He is already three for four tonight. Shatters his bat. And a flip to second one. Baber to first. Double play. The party animals win the opening night five to two. The party animals are able to turn two and win night one of the 2024 World Tour.